بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم صلی اللہ علیہ وآلہ وسلم اللہ رب زبنی علم صلی اللہ علیہ وآلہ وسلم آمین الحمد للہ رب العالمین In this lecture, I will discuss the leftover concepts of pulley. Case 8. The resultant force exerted on the string by the pulley. By the pulley means the direction of the resultant force is towards the pulley. This angle is 45 because of alternate angles. Therefore, this triangle is right angle. And this tension is here. And this tension is here. So by considering this right angle triangle here and by using Pythagoras theorem onto this right angle triangle, we can get the value of the resultant force FR, which is under root 2 times T. Case 9. The resultant force FR on the pulley by the string. By the string means the direction of the resultant force is away from the pulley. In this case, we had by the pulley. So by the pulley means the direction is towards the pulley. And by the string means the direction is away from the pulley. Well, this is the FR and this is uh, the sum of these two tensions. FR is 2T. Case 10. This is the given situation. B is heavier than A. When the system is re released from rest, B will move in this direction and A will move in this direction. Therefore, WB is greater than T and T is greater than WA. With the help of these two inequalities, we can form two equations. And by solving those two equations, we can get the values of tension and acceleration. This is the next stage of this situation. When particles are in motion and this is the third stage when the string breaks when the string breaks B will continue to move in the downward direction and the initial speed or velocity of B is 2 but for A A will continue to move in the upward direction it will reach to its maximum height and then A will come back to this position over here, the velocity of A is 2, but here the velocity of A must be minus 2 because the motion is in opposite direction. It's here. Here, the velocity of A is 2 when A will come to its maximum height and then when A will come to this position, the velocity of A must be minus 2 because of the opposite direction. The motion is in opposite direction. So make sure you must take initial velocity of A minus 2 from this motion, from this point to this point. And G must be 10 because the motion is under gravity. Case 11. This uh, slope is smooth. Given that the slope is smooth, and we need velocity of the system. This is the question. Find the velocity of this system. Well, uh, when, you re when the system is released from rest, B will move in this direction and A will move in this direction. And B is heavier than A. When B strikes the ground, A will be here. And this is the distance of A. So with the help of this distance, we can get the height of A. And the height of A is a small h. And it should be d sin theta. We use sin theta in this right angle triangle. This is the law of conservation of energy. Ei is equal to Ef. So loss in potential energy is equal to kinetic energy of the system. Loss in potential means potential of B minus potential of A. Kinetic energy of the system means half mass of A plus mass of B times V square. You can simplify this as Mg capital H. This is mass of B. M A G and H is D sin theta. And kinetic energy you can write half 
एम ए वी स्क्वेर हाफ एम बी वी स्क्वेर एंड वी नीड वी सो विद दी हेल्प ऑफ दिस वर्क एनर्जी लॉ ऑफ कंजर्वेशन ऑफ एनर्जी थ्योरम वी कैन गेट दिस दिस इज द लॉ ऑफ कंजर्वेशन ऑफ एनर्जी फॉर दिस सिचुएशन केस ट्वेल्व दिस इज द गिवन सिचुएशन एंड द क्वेश्चन इज फाइन टेंशन एंड फाइन नॉर्मल कॉम्पोनेंट ऑफ द कॉन्टेक्ट फोर्स वेल टेंशन मस्ट बी द वेट ऑफ पार्टिकल पी बिकॉज पार्टिकल पी इज हैंग फ्रीली इन द एयर सो टेंशन इज थर्टी न्यूटन्स फॉर नॉर्मल कॉम्पोनेंट यू मस्ट रिजॉल्व दिस टेंशन एंड दिस इज द फोर्स डायग्राम ऑफ दिस सिचुएशन सी दिस एंगल मस्ट बी एल्फा बिकॉज ऑफ ऑल्टरनेट एंगल्स दिस इज हेयर दिस इज नाइंटी डिग्री सो दिस मस्ट बी वन एटी माइनस नाइन्टी एंड एल्फा सो दिस एंगल इज नाइन्टी माइनस एल्फा दिस टेंशन हैज टू कॉम्पोनेंट्स दिस इज द कॉम्पोनेंट विच इज पैरल टू स्लो एंड दिस इज द कॉम्पोनेंट विच इज परपेंडिकुलर टू स्लो दिस कॉम्पोनेंट इज द एडजस्टन ऑफ द ट्राइंगल साइड सो दिस मस्ट बी टेंशन टाइम कॉस नाइन्टी माइनस एल्फा दिस इज द एडजस्टन ऑफ द ट्राइंगल सो दिस शुड बी टी टाइम्स कॉस नाइन्टी माइनस एल्फा टी मीन्स टेंशन एंड टेंशन इज थर्टी सो यू कैन राइट थर्टी टाइम्स कॉस नाइन्टी माइनस एल्फा and cos 90 minus alpha is sin alpha so 30 sin alpha whereas this component is uh, uh in terms of sin because this is uh, the opposite of this triangle so this should be 30 sin 90 minus alpha which is 30 cos alpha so this r must be uh this minus this or you can say r plus this because both are in um, both are in uh, this direction in upward direction from the slope so this should be 40 cos alpha so r is 8 newtons